Hello, my name is Brandon Lee Figueroa. Uh, as you can see, this is my gym, my second home basically. Uh, this is where I prepare for all my fights, uh, mentally and physically. Well, long story short, you know, I've always been a big dreamer since I was small. Um, when I was born, I was already around boxing because of my older brother. My dad taught my older brother due to self-defense. Uh, but I did it out of, you know, my brother as my idol, me always having to catch up to him and trying to make my dad proud because I know my dad loves boxing. So ever since I was little, I always tried to strive to, to beat my older brother. And uh, any sport that my older brother did, he, he was the best in football, basketball, in anything that, that, that he touched, he was basically the best. So I tried to compete with him, I couldn't. I was too small, too scrawny. I had a thinner frame than my older brother. But when it came to boxing, uh, I knew that I had, I had a gift for this and I was born to fight. And it was the only sport where I can kind of compete with my brother. So, you know, now we're here 20 years later, since I was four, big, dreaming big, and I'm living my dreams. So, yeah, hard work, a lot of hard work and dedication. I was staying in, in, in shape. I was staying fight ready, just in case someone wants to fight in two months, I'll be ready. But yeah, you know, I, I come in the morning with my sister, work out, strength and conditioning. She's also my nutritionist. She does my meals to make sure that I make weight for my fights, which is another very important aspect in, in, in a professional boxer is making weight uh, and obviously looking good physically. But most importantly, making sure that you go to the fight 100% and healthy as possible. So yeah, you know, I come in the morning, do my strength and conditioning, and then I come later in the afternoon, I'm around 6.30 p.m and I do my boxing, I go run, run my three miles. If I don't spar, I do mitt work with my dad. You know, my, I, love, I love this, you know, this is my passion. Uh, I don't see myself doing anything else but this. I've been in love with this sport since I was four years old and, you know, my dad has always been there behind me. My family, you know, my sister, my, my strength and conditioning coach, my nutritionist, my dad, he's my coach. My mom pushes me, my older brother. And yeah, you know, it's just a, a family affair of, of boxers and, you know, they just want to see me be the best uh, boxer that I can. I can honestly care less about the fame. I just want to help my people, my community, and obviously the, the kids that, that look up to me. Um, you know, this year I couldn't have a, a toy drive. I couldn't have a back to school drive uh, due to the pandemic going on. But best believe that if next year everything clears up, uh, I'm going to make sure to accommodate the kids. You know, I love making the kids happy because I used to be them. I used to look up to professional boxers when I was small and it just felt nice for them to just buy me a happy meal and if I can do so much more for the kids then I will do it. Oh uh, yes, you know, it's just hard work, dedication, consistency, you know, uh, on the off season when I'm supposed to be vacationing, you know, I come to the gym, run my miles, I work here and there, and, you know, always staying busy, always staying consistent, making sure that, you know, I never fall off the grid too much or I never, you know, let my body go too much or my conditioning, you know. Uh, I'm always ready to work, I'm always ready to fight, and that's the most important thing is just being consistent, dedicated, and as long as you love what you do, you will never get tired of it. You know, this new year, um, I'm trying to open a, a boxing gym here in Westaco. It's gonna be probably one of the best boxing gyms here in the Valley. Um, study the art, of course, uh, and open it to the public. I wanna do uh, uh, a lot of community work in there. I wanna help a lot of kids, maybe, uh, get some buses and transport kids that, you know, may, maybe get them off the streets and maybe get them into boxing. You know, I just, I just want to do a lot of things with the gym, which is right now is my main focus. And obviously, you know, keep fighting, keep training, keep getting better and just keep improving myself. Once again, thank you guys for the support uh, from the whole Valley. I know you guys are always 100% with me. Um, thank you for following my journey. Uh, details need to come for my next fight. But yeah, y'all can keep up with me, catch up with me on social media. Brandon Figueroa 101 on Instagram, Brandon uh, Lee Fig 25 on uh, Twitter. And yeah, you know, thank you guys for the support. Appreciate it.